the way that he's doing. Genie's gonna run away from Nev, turn around, pivot. Hit. Well, that's that's actually incorrect. He's gonna double jab and then uh, turn around and pivot grab. That's a standard Genie combo. In this game that's very defensive. All right. Let's see how this match wins out here. You know, War is a relatively Ooh, new character being that. DLC, so. Yep. Who, who's supposed to win this matchup? I, I think it might be in Roy. Is it in Roy's favor? I feel like it's in Ness's, honestly, but that's just because I think Ness is such a. I have not seen this matchup played before. Well, I do know that a lot of people like to counterpick uh, when they are going to some map, they like to pick Mark. Yeah, that's true. The spacing. Yeah, the spacing would be different because of the sweet spot. Yeah, so. exactly. Well, Ooh, Game oh, Genie just, gets hit with the back here. Shout yeah. out to that commentator's curse. Yeah. This is, this has a aerial, so I expect, well, what I'd expect Genie to do is to just kind of sit and never try and play anything. Um, you know, with Nessa's great aerial priority, he's probably going to win the F smash. Gonna take it. That. Good job to Game Genie taking that yeah. first stop very quickly without gaining any damage at all. You can't underestimate that side beat from lots of those sword characters. That's going to pack on just a bit of damage. Oh, an amazing. Oh, oh it was, it was like, man. Nev misses the fair combo from that. Do you think it might play a little part into Roy being a fast faller, or...? Um, I think so. It might have just been a percentage thing as well. And like well, I said, at 36%. I, haven't, I haven't seen this matchup play. See him. Ooh. Oh, and Genie Game runs Genie. in, absorbing Ness's shock. Ness's and UK Thunder. Genie. Very smart move by Genie. For a second, I thought he was in trouble there because Roy's recovery is not that good. Game Genie looks just as confused as everybody else. Game Genie with his, uh, with his classic, um, what? probably type of moment that he uh, stated in his head right that, there. That he's trademarked there. All right, it's looking like Spanky J might need to speak up a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I'll, uh, it's not usually a problem for me. I tend to be a pretty loud person, but I will, I will definitely speak up and try and ignore all these statements that Twig has <laughs> about me. So apparently uh, Spanky likes to go around campus barefoot, which would not surprise me. <laughs> you do give off that Lord of the Rings Hobbit feel. I do. I do. I don't think they wear shoes. Alright, so uh, we're here doing stage bands, which I know Game C Genie takes very seriously. So yeah, very seriously. Gonna, he was trying to hold up the bracket again there. Okay, and Nev is going to be pulling out Yoshi. Game Gene is one of those people, he's going to ask what the stage listing is every single match. It's like, it didn't change from last match, Game Gene. All right, so I could have, I think I saw them. Yep, they're going to Battlefield. Going to Battlefield. Ooh, now, this was interesting. To to Yoshi. Um, Genie is a big fan of Battlefield, but perhaps the counterpick will work better in Yoshi's favor. We'll just have to see how that works. See if Yoshi can use those Nev platforms Nev to Nev Reppin, the red Yoshi color that Yoshi. I was using earlier. Um, ooh. There goes Yoshi's fair. Yoshi, Yoshi's fair. Good spacing tool. Oh, a little bit of a dangerous move. He managed to just space it out to work it out there. Yeah, but have to see what Yo Yoshi's nair is just so surprisingly overpowering. Like if you just look at it, it's just a little tiny foot. But it's just like Mario and Luigi's nair, really. Yeah. Application, you know what it actually looks like. Hitbox and everything. Trying to trying to bait out the air dodge there it seemed. Game Genie never did it. Oh, Ooh, and that boy, that's not gonna take it because go. Yoshi is a heavy character. That is not gonna It also is kind of hard. Wow, the reach on that up smash. Got him with the tip of the toe, it looked like. Ooh, 
So Game Genie's not out of it yet, though. He's a smart player. He knows not to panic. Shoutouts to Pedal Bear for just showing yeah, up Pedal in time Bear here right in the here. Building. Thanks for stopping in. He will probably hop here on the mic in a little bit. Yeah, most likely. So we Genie have Dame Genie trying to keep Yoshi off the stage. It doesn't but, look like he's... But it's not going to help him when he really nice needs tech to... There, he's got to get this kill soon. Yeah. He's gonna, oh, and the up B just it was, barely... Just, Yoshi out Man, here. Roy's up B is just so amazing. Like it, it's a, it's a, it's a, oh yeah, I, I would I would go and say that it's a better kill move than, than Zero Suits. I think it's harder to get out of. That is definitely true. Zero Suits is a vegan like SDI in or just uh, base yourself all or even if you're at the right percentage, it's not going to change. But Roy is so the problem here is, though, Genie's at kill percentage. Oh, yeah. Um, and Nev's sitting pretty comfortably. Of course, you can never count out Roy. You can expect that F smash if it, if he, you know, spots it really well. You know, give Nevin, like, another 20 or 30 damage. To the edge. Yoshi's gone. And then we'd be going to game three. Ooh. And, once and again, with the bear up into up air. air. Oh, game Perhaps we can call that Yoshi's hoo-ha right there. Oh, man. So Nev taking game two from Genie. If, if Nev would have lost 2-0 to Game Genie, we wouldn't have let him live that down today. Not at all. Man. I mean, we would have been game teaming him in the group chat. Up and, and now we got people continuing to bag on me. Dare me the type of dude to say we <laughs> We won't nunchuck. Run out of batteries. Uh, Sky Resin, I do not believe Roy's up B has super armor. Um, it's like, say, Mario's up B or something. I don't think it has super armor. I don't think it has super armor, but uh, it's just really hard to get to the right side of where you can punish him. Okay, so I'm about to What's step that? off. We're going to have uh, Rodney or RC Jr. Uh, hop in here on the commentary. So GG's everybody and keep bagging on me. Alright. Looks like we got a confirmation from Skillager, but it does have Whoa, well, let's ask Genie. It may have a couple of frames there. Right. Okay. What's Looks going like on? Sorry we got my boy RC Jr. back here. Man, what's up guys? Man, dude, doing you know work over there in the losers man, bracket. Man, I can't stand fighting those anymore, but I had to go ahead and just take her out, man. Who, who was it? Was it Hot Dog Night? It was Hot Dog Night. I hate it. I hate it had to be him, but hey. You know, I like Hot Dog Night, man. He likes to smile. Right. It's not. <laughs> right. All right, man. Well, let's get this underway. We got BFG Dev versus BFG Game Genie. Man, it's nice to see Game Genie on stream finally, man. I haven't seen that all day. Man, so let me give you a quick recap there. Repping that uh, Robin. First match, Game Genie right. went Roy. Okay. And then uh, Nev actually went Ness. Okay. Roy won. Okay. And then the second match, Nev went to Yoshi and took out that Roy. Mm. So then we have Game Genie here picking Robin. He killed Roy in the air? Uh, yeah, it was Sounds a about uh, right. okay. uh, down throw to up air. Either that or it was a spike to up air. Yeah. Okay. Well, man. Regardless, man, we still got a very intense match right here going on right now. These are two very, very highly skilled players. Man, guys I really, really love to watch. Um, it's always nice to see games when you come out to these things, man. You never know sometimes. Yeah, you never know if he's going to be able to drive out here. Or you have to take a plane. You know games when he's famous. We have some salt here in the crowd. Pedal Bear coming at Spanky. Talking about how he's out of the tournament. Losing the sorry tag. Yeah. What the? Okay, well, anyway, back, back to this. Back to this match, man. We got Robin going ahead. He's taking that first stock off of Yoshi, man. But, you know, one thing I can't say about you know, Nev is that he plays better under pressure. I mean. That's what the best players do, man. Yeah. I mean, they, I mean, they play better when the pressure's on, man. When it's game seven and there's 30 seconds left, what can you really do? Ooh, man. Man, you know, everybody's looking. You got to come out on top. Right, man. My grandma's at home watching this match. Man. What am I going to do if I lose? My grandma's at home. Man. Make your grandma take time out of her day just to watch you lose? Right. I'm well. My, my grandma will give me some words. Right. Fun fact about Game Genie is that um, he actually doesn't do a lot of dodging or a lot of rolling. 
is very shield heavy. Yeah. It was like in the comments that we have Jeremy's the type of dude thing going on. Let's go ahead and make that hashtag on Twitter. Hashtag Jeremy the type of dude on Facebook too. Um, for what it's looking like, it's looking like Jeremy's related to Drake as well. So Drake the type of dude, Jeremy the type of dude. They seem very, very similar in uh, stature, but anyway. Whoa. Oh, and the Force Mask is going to do it, and we got almost an even match here, man. We got Yoshi at about 60% and Robin at a fresh stop. So let's see where this match takes us. Um, Dude, these are hilarious. Guys at home, if you're just tuning in, this is HTC Tuesday, and this is your man, Rod the Dutch, with my main man, that one, Blackhead, and we love to do this. Hopefully my man, Davey Castle, gets on the commentary tonight, but who knows, man. He just walked in the door, but these uh these comments are going crazy right now in the stream, guys. This is what it's all about, man. If you got something to say, just go ahead and post it up in there, man. We respond. We talk back. You can talk to us on Twitter at, at Smash Nebraska. You know, we're starting to gain some followers, finally. Um, we love tweeting about everything Smash related, especially our community, Omaha, Nebraska, and just Nebraska in general. So, I mean, that's... Shout out, shout out to Spanky being a very considerate person for turning down the TV when his cat's sleeping. Oh, man. Spanky the type of dude to turn down the TV while his cat's sleeping. Okay, I don't know if we can confirm this, but uh, it's not looking too good for Yoshi right now. We got, uh, we got Game G at a very comfortable 62%. Oh, Ooh, dirty! The fair. the fair will do. He took him, took him to the county fair. Oh, 